are you? I need you out here. Thanks. Everybody wants to see you. Not you hiding in the pillows. Here. How about that? Hi everyone! Are you wondering how big an 11 week old Kavapoo puppy is? Well, I'm gonna let you know how big my 11, he's actually 11 and a half weeks old now, Kavapoo puppy is for reference. And to give you a better idea, Sawyer's mom, who was a, who is a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel, was 15 pounds. And his dad, a cream-colored poodle, is nine pounds. So, of course, it's always a good idea to know how big the parents are to get a better idea. But generally, Cavaliers are between that 15 and 20 pound range. And mini poodles, if, if your dog's dad was a mini poodle and not a toy poodle, which they generally are minis, then they're in that range of, you know, nine, 10 pounds. Okay, so let's get to it. And he's in kind of a busy mood, as you can see, and he's full on in his teething mode, but we're going to do the best we can. Oh, actually, before we even get to the measurements, we're gonna talk weight. He was at his first vet visit three days ago and his weight was 4.37 pounds. And of course, I'm gonna put all of the metrics on the screen too, if that's what you use. Um, excuse me, we're gonna need that. Sorry. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to hold him for this because he is so squirmy. We're gonna do his girth, which is right under their little armpits, right behind their front legs. And this measurement is important for knowing what size harness they are going to take. So he is... After you get rid of all the fluff, he is about 12, a little less. I'm gonna say 11 and a half on his girth. Okay, so I already had this Voyager brand harness in an extra small for my Chihuahua who is six pounds. And this is actually quite big on him on the shoulders and everything he can really get out of it. I only tried it on him one time but that is no good, so we are definitely gonna have to buy him his own. He will grow into that one, but we're not, we're not there yet. And we're not rushing you because you're so small and cute. Oh, now you're getting tired. Okay, so we're gonna move on and we're gonna do his length and we're gonna do it from his little puppy shoulder blades to where his tail is. And that measurement is 10 and a half inches. So he is 10 and a half inches long. And he's really good about me handling him as a side note, which is so important. We're gonna make so many more videos on stuff like this, but every day since I got him, I'm looking in his ears, I'm opening his mouth, give me a mouth, you know, and really, um, getting him used to being handled a lot. You really want to do that, especially if you're going to have a curly, a very curly Kavapoo, like he's not, but, and if they're going to need to be groomed by you or somebody else, you also want to really start handling their paws, just gently squeezing them and pushing out their little nails because that's going to be something you're going to want to do. But that's for another video. Right now, we're going to also do his height. Okay, so I put him down and now I'm gonna do his height measurement, which is from, of course, his foot to his shoulder blades, which is called the withers. And I don't wanna bother him too much because it looks like it's nap time over here, but I'm just going to do this real quick so we can finish this up and you guys have all the measurements of an 11 week old little Kava Poo. Come there, sweetheart. Okay, so it looks like nine inches, and that one's not super exact, of course, because I don't want to bother him too much, but we could say that that is pretty, pretty accurate. We really hope that you found this helpful, and if so, please leave us a like. Also, subscribe to us, and thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye!